Once we are done looking by eye, we have to take a series of steps to ensure that we can look at the sample with the spinning disc confocal. So first, we need to make sure that we uh, push this slider in to block the ability of light to reach the eyepieces. The reason for this, is, as I said before, uh, this triggers an interlock with the lasers. If this is pulled out, the lasers won't turn on, so we won't be able to see anything. I'm going to push that in. The second is we need to make sure that uh, this arm is lowered. If it's in this position, the lasers will not turn on. There's a second interlock that controls that. The next thing we need to do is to make sure uh, that the turret position is in number one. That's the same position as the bright field. And the reason for that is that position number one is an empty position, which allows the lasers to uh, get into the sample without any problem. So right now it is not on position number one. So I'm going to rotate this and put it in position one. Finally, we need to make sure that the light can go to the cameras, which are on the left of the system, as opposed to the eyepiece. So we're going to press this to make sure the light can go to those cameras. Now, uh, if you are trying to look at things by eye, or you are trying to, think, to look at things with the confocal and you can't see anything, we have a number of instructions here on the wall that will help you troubleshoot this. If you can't find your sample, here are some things that should be different between the eye and the confocal. So you can read those there uh, if you're uh, ever in that situation. Here's a troubleshooting list if you can't find a sample by eye. And here's a troubleshooting list if you can't find a sample by confocal. So again, if you run into this problem where you think you've set everything up correctly, but you still can't get any light to and from your sample, uh, take a look at those checklists and uh, hopefully they will, they will um, give you the series of steps that you need to undertake to be able to see uh, the sample either by eye or with the cameras in spinning disc confocal mode.